Hi there and welcome to another installment of World Football News. This time round we will be looking at an article that appeared in One Football. It reads, From Warning to Reality. Rodri's injury reignites concerns over player overburdening. Manchester City were dealt a significant blow this week as midfielder Rodri sustained a serious injury. The Spanish international, a key figure in Pep Guardiola's side, will be sidelined for an extended period, raising concerns about the team's chances in both domestic and European competitions. The Premier League club released a statement confirming the player's injury. The midfielder travelled to Spain to seek specialist, uh, specialist consultation this week, following initial tests in Manchester. Assessment remains ongoing to ascertain the full extent of the injury and expected prognosis. Everyone at the club wishes him a speedy recovery and mancity.com will bring you regular updates regarding his rehabilitation. Pep Guardiola is trying to not give up. He confirms that Roger has a serious injury and will be out for some time but the manager is not giving up hope, suggesting that there is a chance the player will return to action earlier. We will find a solution. When one player is irreplaceable, we have to do it as a team and this is going to happen. Last season we had three months without Erling, five months without De Bruyne and we won the Premier League, said Guardiola. One doctor said it is a big, big injury. The other said it's probably not as much, but we will see. Now it is important to support him. Safe recovery. I would say not even a speedy recovery. A safe recovery for his future and for his career. The football schedule is getting tighter and tighter. Footballers play non-stop for almost the entire year. When the club season ends, there is usually a representative tournament or an additional tournament for the best clubs. The reforms of the UEFA Champions League and Club World Cup competitions add even more matches for the strongest teams that will stay in them as long as possible. More and more voices are coming from the community calling for serious changes because there are currently too many matches which directly affect the physical and mental health of players, coaches and club employees. The irony is that Rodri, one of the first players to speak out against the increasingly tight schedule, is now facing a serious injury himself. He previously warned of a potential player strike if the fixture list continues to be overloaded, arguing that exceeding 40 to 50 games per season negatively impacts players' physical and mental health. Rodri used his press conference ahead of the Champions League clash with Inter Milan to warn of a potential strike by players. The Manchester City star has not ruled out the possibility of one finally happening if the fixture list continues to be filled with extra matches. He hopes UEFA and FIFA will come to the conclusion that the players should not be overburdened. I think we are close to that. It is easy to understand. I think it is something general. I think if you ask any player he will say the same. It's not the opinion of Rodri or whatever, said Rodri. I think it's the general opinion of the players. And if it keeps this way, there will be a moment where we have no other option. I really think, but let's wait and see. I do not know what is going to happen, but it is something that worries us because we are the guys that suffer in the end. I don't have an exact number. From my experience, I can tell you that 60 to 70 games a season. No, between 40 or 50 is the amount of games in which a player can perform at the highest level. After that, you drop because it is impossible to sustain the same physical level. This year we can go to 70 or maybe even 80 games, I don't know. Depends how far you go in the competitions. In my humble opinion, I think it is too much. I think we have to take care of ourselves. Someone has to take care of the players. As Rodri recovers, football fans around the world will undoubtedly miss his exceptional talent, skill and masterful performances on the pitch. Everyone at Get Football wishes him a speedy recovery. That then brings us to the end of this piece of news which was published in Get Football. So give us your thoughts on this particular piece of news and we can discuss it further. We will also keep you updated on what is going on with Manchester City players as well as how Rodri is progressing with his injury. Until next time though, this is World Football News.